Hey y'all. Alrighty, I finished my book. It was really good. I've enjoyed it. And I got another book. It's a Christian romance, Hooked on You. But it had yarn for the cover. And it's a new book. So, yeah. Because our library is, um, this one is by Beth Kathleen Fuller. It's supposed to be a Maple Falls romance. I don't know. I try to look for the new stickers because our our library is really, really small. It's in an old bank building and a lot of the books I've read, I've, I've read. Um, so I'm always looking out for the newer books. Um, but you can also get library loan or is it they can loan it from Abilene library I think it's called I don't enter loan enter something loan I don't know um so if I get two where I don't have absolutely anything to read and again then um then I can do that you can actually get an Abilene li library card for ten dollars a year uh because you're not in Abilene but um our, they do that because our library is so small um, that they open up their library for us people in Clyde so yeah so let me show you what Rainbow Parfait like I said this is open for beads but I'm not putting beads I did find on Etsy. I love Etsy. That they had this lot. Um, it's silver charms. It's silver charms um, lot. And I thought, well, that would be cool to. Let me see if I can pull it up real quick. Um, Yeah, mixed lot of 100, 200, 300, or 500 Tibetan silver charms, bracelet charms, bolt charms, bolt silver charms, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, it starts at eleven ninety nine. I was like, uh, yes, please. Can I have that? And then there's another one that's clean bolt charms, pick, pick your silver charms. Um, you can get you oh this one's only 40 charms for 1120 but anyway there's there's silver charm lots and or bulk lots and I thought well that would be a great idea that I could then I could pick out you know some matching charms on y'all know what I'm trying to say <laughs> me and the words just ain't working today I'm having problem I don't know if it's this new meds or what but my thinking I already had brain fog to begin with but it has gotten worse and with PTSD I already have memory issues that's gotten worse so I don't know what is going on and I don't know if it's the medicine or whatever the case may be but I'm not very happy with it because I look like a total sound like a total idiot that doesn't know what the hell they're talking about and it's sometimes true because I can't get myself together uh, why do we have to be on so many meds why so anyway I'm gonna try to this month I'm going to try to get as much as I can on plum pudding done um, I do have crochet in the house behind me but I'm saving that to take with me to the hospital uh, I don't know how long I'll be gone um, probably not very long uh, 
but going this time around I've been trying to go long term so I can do physical therapy every day uh, because last time I was they were needing me to go to Abilene three times a week for physical therapy I can't do that financially I cannot do that um, and it'll be my right leg this time so that's my driving leg I mean obviously some people drive with both feet I've noted I, I've, I've been told some people drive with both feet you do you boo boo whatever works so um, but if I do get long-term temporary long-term if that makes sense then I can already be there and already be doing rehab so got the left knee done now we're going to do the right knee and call it a day so anyway guys I love you guys and I will wrap it up and I will talk to you later bye y'all